So today we struck a deal on the USMCA, and let me be clear, I am still going to support it. Uh, it's too important of a trade deal to pass up. However, I need you to know something. You need to understand what the Democrats viewed as a negotiating win. Get this. So a fundamental part of the USMCA, as it was originally negotiated, was patent protection. Okay, specifically with biological drugs made in the US. In the US, patents last for 12 years, okay? Under the previous NAFTA deal, those protections only went out to five years in Canada and Mexico, which meant they could copy our drugs and give their own citizens cheaper drug prices at the expense of Americans. When we renegotiated the USMCA, we extended that to 10 years which means that it was good for Americans, all Americans, not just the ones making the drugs, but for the people who were actually buying them, okay? Because we were no longer paying for Canadians and Mexicans to get cheaper copycat drugs. In the recent negotiation, the Democrats didn't like that. And instead, they renegotiated it to be zero years. We no longer have protections for our companies making cutting edge drugs. It means that in Mexico and Canada now, they can simply copy those drugs. It doesn't have to go through the FDA and Mexican citizens and Canadian citizens can get access to the drugs that American companies have spent money putting research and development in. What does this do to our drug prices? It increases our drug prices. It's great for Canadians and Mexicans and it's great for you if, if you happen to be traveling to Mexico or Canada and you want a copycat drug that hasn't been vetted by the FDA but that doesn't apply to most people, okay? You have to know that the Democrats considered this a win. It's not a win for America. Again, I'm still gonna vote for the USMCA. The, the deal is too big not to, but I want you to know the truth about what Democrats considered a win in negotiations.